Hello, good morning, good day, bonsuere, como esta, como sava, how are you doing? I hope you're doing great, you're doing well. I hope you still find the courage and the love to face each day. Early in this morning, let us spend this precious moment to be with our Creator, our Maker, and our loving God. Today, we will reflect on the Book of Imitation of Christ by Thomas Acampas in his first book, Chapter 7. Of fleet, fleeing from vain hope and pride, vain is the life that that man who put his trust in man or any created thing. Be not ashamed to be the servant of others for the love of Jesus Christ and to be reckoned poor in this life. Rest not upon thyself, but build thy hope in God. Do what lie in thy power, and God will help thy good intent. Trust not in thy learning, nor in the cleverness of any that lives, but rather trust in the favor of God, who resist the proud and give grace to the humble. Boast not thyself in thy riches, if you have them, nor in thy friends, if they be powerful, but in God, who gives all things, and in addition to all things, decide to give even himself. Be not lifted up because of the strength or beauty of the body, or with only a slight sickness it will fall and wither away. Be not vain of thy skillfulness or ability, lest you displease God, for whom come every good gift which we have. Count not thyself better than others, lest by chance you appear worst in the sight of God, who know what is in man. Be not proud of thy good works, for God's judgments are of another sort than the judgments of men. And what pleases man is oftentimes displeasing to him. If you has any good, believe that others have more, and, and you may preserve the humility. It is no harm to thee if you play thyself below all others, but it is great harm if you place thyself above even one. Peace is ever with the humble man, but in the heart of the proud, there is envy and continual wrath. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen.